I'm an ENT allergist uh, that does ENT uh, and food and environmental allergy work. And in my practice, um, I'm new to New Hampshire. I've been here for the last year and started uh, the first allergy clinic um, at Littleton Regional Hospital in northern New Hampshire. Um, we see a lot of chronic conditions, including chronic ear infections, uh, wheezing, which leads into uncontrolled asthma in the childhood state. And we know if we can in, uh, intervene during those episodes uh, and help control whether it's food or environmental allergies, those chronic conditions are less apt to develop and become long life uh, problems. Yeah, yeah, well that's great. And, and, and this is really more preventative. Well, it's, 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 it's a key to identify really what's causing the issue versus just treating an infection and really getting to the root cause of what's causing chronic infection, whether it be in the ears or the throat or the sinuses. And it, it affects children and adults alike. But um, rather than giving someone a treatment and reacting to an infection that is recurring, I try to step back and try to find out what's causing that. And a lot of chronic sinus and chronic, chronic ear issues can be related to uncontrolled allergy. So my goal is to try to identify what's causing the recurrence of these infections and really deal with it at that level versus reacting to the infection. Yeah. Any particular ones pop to mind that are most prevalent that you're coming across? Um, really chronic ear infection, um, early asthma, chronic wheezing, chronic eczema, uh, chronic skin conditions. We know if those are uncontrolled all end up with a, hyper, a hyperactive airway, which is upper airway and lower airway, and then that leads into asthma. So those are the, the, the keys that primary care physicians now are becoming more educated and referring to myself for you know, um, evaluation for allergy. And we've had great success with identifying problem uh, antigens as well as controlling it then with shots and or medications.